going on guys? Tom Jerex here with another POV video. Sony A6000 today with the Viltrox 50mm lens. This one is the full frame lens, but there's an alternative 56mm f1.4. This one's f1.8 and um, yeah, I'm just gonna test it out how it looks like on uh, Sony A6000. Have a bit of a weird setup here uh, with the phone and the Axon Cinei recorder so you guys can actually see uh, exactly what's on the screen. And I'm here in uh, Lisbon, so I'm gonna be just walking around some random streets and taking photos of random things and I hope you enjoy. I like the background being blurry, so with this 50 millimeter lens, it's really nice because on APS-C it's about 80, 85 millimeters and gives a, a nice compression. Also, when you get close to the subject, the background is going to blur quite nice. I think this uh, combo could be really good for portraits as well. But I'm a bit shy to go too close to the people and take portraits of them, so I might just sneak up on someone. Just a little bit. <laughs> oh, there's some market going on. Maybe this is our chance. Can shoot. That's nice, some details. I always like to be a little bit, a bit away from the people. So they don't feel like I'm uh, in their zone, in their space. Some people sitting, chilling. It's a really nice light here today. We don't want to see him blowing the nose, so we'll just move on. Let's try some indoor shots in a train station. Let's see how that goes. I'll probably have to set up the ISO a little bit higher because uh, it's not as much light. So I'm gonna go with like ISO 8 400 and the f-stop I will also sit to the maximum f1.8. Where's the, where's the train yo? Where are the trains at? Metro underground. Ah, uh, okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna go to Metro instead, <laughs> can't find the train. I don't know where it is. It must be somewhere around, but who knows. Yeah, the shutter speed is quite decent, with one against 640. So if your pictures come out blurry, you know, you have to increase either the ISO or the F-stop in order to make the shutter speed quicker because when it's quick, then you will have non-blurry pictures. That's the most common issue. Nothing interesting here, I don't know. Let's just try. I'll change the focus to middle so I can concentrate on the very end of it. 
I'm just trying to get some more interesting lines perhaps like that oh okay yeah now now you see the shutter speed was really low so I'm gonna increase the ISO that's better because I think this photo with the shutter speed one against 80 is probably gonna be a bit blurry if you zoom in all the way but yeah so that's why the shutter speed really need to keep an eye on that I am not a fan of this metro place nothing much to see here things in uh, foreground that it gives a little bit of that blurriness like those guys see I put some things in front it gives uh, actually a nice reflection okay not bad but could be a little bit better um, separation from the background that that's what I like more so now that we are heading out you see the shutter speed can't handle so that's because the ISO is way too high so I'm just gonna put it back to 100 there we go and it's still too bright so I need to decrease the f-stop to something like 2.8 she's there's nothing around where where the hell am I oh okay there's a plane there's a plane coming you see it I'll change the autofocus area to something like zone and middle to help the autofocus handle it a little bit better. Damn, that's, that was really close how that plane went. Okay. I don't know maybe got some cool shots maybe need to like zoom in a little bit crop in and then maybe we'll have I really like the one here this one between the buildings Ooh, nice love it it's windy here but it seems like there's a lot of things going on I want to capture uh, the girl going on a scooter just gonna change the uh, autofocus to wide and see that ah, they're not gonna come yet just gonna go down a little bit here they go okay that was too fast that was way too fast I was not expecting the speeds like that but okay maybe we got it something I don't know I like the guy there ducking down I'm gonna change the focus area so it focuses on where I want the camera to focus on so like that come on catch the guy f1.8 I'm just going to change the focus area even more to the flexible spot because I really want specifically him to be here so that I can put the fire hydrant right in front oh, and there's a guy walking so maybe that will create a cool frame 
perhaps and also go like really low maybe it will be a nice photo who knows all right let's go see what else we got oh I shit the plane okay this is a nice spot actually GoPro is recording, all is good. Some Mambalan. Driving around. Some action happening here. The hell's going on in here? So actually now that I'm thinking, maybe we can do something fun with that plane. Um, if I'm somewhere there and the plane and the plane flies over there yeah the guy thought I'm talking to him well that's the one weird thing <laughs> with walking around with GoPro and talking to you guys people think I'm sick you know <laughs> I just like <laughs> talking to myself pointing things and uh yeah it's weird yo it's really weird but you gotta do what you gotta do <laughs> all right so i'm gonna go over to the other side i'm gonna wait for the for the plane to come i think that's gonna look good so while i was waiting i saw where the plane is gonna come it's gonna come from that side and uh and go right in front of here so I'm just gonna wait a sec until it arrives until then maybe we can take some photos of a guy just chilling there I'm gonna frame it a bit better so I like that scooter I think it's pretty cool how it looks so I'm gonna put f1.8 whoa auto focus focus on the yeah there we go i'm just creating like sort of like this reflection from the car just to give it a little bit nicer oh the plane the plane is coming we are ready should be somewhere here one shot one opportunity yo ah. <laughs> forgot to change I forgot to change to a burst so I had only one shot but holy smokes the Emirates is here and we got the shot Woo! stoked all right guys that's a wrap up my name is Tom Sirex I really hope you enjoyed the video if you did subscribe because I'm gonna be making more videos like these with the Sony a6000 with more cameras more lenses POVs and all other good stuff so I see you all in the next video very soon. Bye.